Hey guys, um, you know it's getting close to Halloween, and I decided to kind of make a haunted house. I wish I can kind of show you it better, but I'm going to kind of show you it. I'll show you with the light on, too, because this camera sucks and doesn't really pick up everything. But, I mean, also some stuff that are lit up. Um, I'm going to say I did okay. My siblings didn't think it's too scary, but, you know, they're, ch they're children. They're children. They don't even understand. But, I mean, it looks nice. They all, all at the same time, but, of course, I mean, light on is going to look different. More stuff going into it. Of course, you can't see this right there in the dark, and a lot of stuff you can't really see around the room with how much more effort is actually put into this than it looks. So a lot of stuff you can't see. Of course, I would be able to see it. I can see it in the dark, but because the camera makes it a little less visible. Just, you know, camera. But, hmm. Let me try something actually. Let's see if that's even any better. I don't think it would be. Um. Okay, that's. I'll just carry the slush head around so you actually see one in the dark. So, let's see how better this much further this is. Like, see the desk? I'm far away, you can't really see anything now. Okay. I have to kind of let it sit then? Or, what? I mean, it was working, what was it? It was like blue before. What the heck, man? Okay, you can actually see this. But you get more out there, you can't see anything. But it was like just blue though. Whoa. If I had more powerful flashlight. But I guess you can kinda look up close to it. Looks creepy. Of course, this is gonna look somewhat creepy just with a flashlight and just like I can to look up there, it looks creepy with the flashlight and stuff. And you're just looking around, you know. Just see a skull and some beautiful eyes. But, uh, yeah, I mean. It's, I use a lot of stuff. I use a little play dress. That was in our. Uh, just found it. I kind of like put a black wig on it so you can if I can show you the wig so there's a wig it's kind of blending in with the oh jeez come on just spinning too fast still stay still so you can see the wig right there and kind of make it look like it's a girl from the ring kind of just hanging there you know and a bunch of black sheets around to kind of make it more spooky. And this, more work put into that, that, and it looks. And this is actually just some orange lights under there. And I put a old blind, some old blinds that mom was going to have me, was going to have me throw away. I was like, you know, I could probably use this. And it actually works. Kind of looks like vents in a way, and of course you can see it from down there more. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, more invisible like that. Kind of see under there. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, I think. Well, I'm going to start doing more Halloween-related videos now that it is October and such. So, yeah, you can see the blinds there. I can make some creepy videos if you want me to. I can kind of have, like, set up like this. And, like, kind of, like, at the wall or something, and, like... Like that, you know, like kind of let me demonstrate. I don't even know how it looks. Kind of, kind of like me out 
It'll be in my closet. It's like creeps out. And like that, such. But it'd be like mask, costume. I don't know. Maybe just some, to get some content. Anyway, so this is just really a haunted house of me. I was limited on my resources, but I made it work. And I'm gonna leave some of this stuff up, cause it took me a while. I'm gonna take it down. Lights, I'm gonna turn off, of course, but yeah, I'm gonna leave it there for a while. I don't know, but yeah. Okay, see. It is kind of harder because the. Uh... Oh. Yeah. Okay, so. A lot of stuff for the flesh, right? It makes it look a little more creepy in the dark. Yeah, I mean. I guess I'll. No, I'll just kind of go over what I did for this some of this stuff. Which is really simple. This right here. It's literally just, there is literally a tack in the ceiling going down into a dress with, of course, it's actually not a wig, it's actually just a mask. A mask, a little creepy mask. And this is just easy with some fake candles and a little pumpkin, which is a big mask and another fake candle. Just kind of make it as creepy as possible. I'm going to be decorating the room some more. So yeah, and there's actually a rat here, I guess you could never saw that fake rat, of course. I guess you can't really have uh, seen that. Alright, some creepy music in the background, that's always fun. So I had to cover my window with this. I'm in the basement, so. Window is right there, curving right there, just that little window. And this right here, you couldn't even see this in the dark, you just, well, with a flashlight you kind of could. So really just like, that's the box the blinds were in, so, hey. You can see the blinds more here. The light in there is literally just plugged in and in there. Um, this right here actually went to one of my costumes. It lights up. It fades light, fades in and out. And I put a little headless thing. They both came to the same thing. It was supposed to be a costume with like shoulder pads on it, and makes it look like you're the headless hunchman, and like you'll be holding your head practically. So that was fun. I was gonna use this as a fake axe. Also went with the costume. Had a handle before. Just completely forgot about it. Didn't use it. I don't know. Could have been like. Okay. Last Halloween. I was a little stupid. I was just like, I didn't really care about what I made. And behind this poster, if I can get it off without ripping it. You know, I'll, I'll rip it a little. That's fine, I guess. Looks like I'll show you. I literally stuck it in my wall right there. I made it kind of look like an axe there. Well, so of course, it was an axe head. And I just did that. Of course, now it's covered up. And it's better now. Great. I'm going to have to retake that. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Um, Over here, just another bunch of stuff. Make it look darker. No windows there, but just like some black around so it doesn't everything is not white. And didn't want I didn't cover all my drawings because like I'm not gonna do that. I'll probably make another video going over my drawings if you're interested, you know. But that's pretty much everything. Yeah. I have a big Mountain Dew collection there, a bunch of movies. But yeah, I think I'm gonna end it here. I pretty much went over everything. And there's a table under this, obviously, but yeah, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna end it here because I just kind of wanted to go over it, show it to you guys, showcase it. Not a mod showcase, but you know. Oh, I guess one more thing. Right, there's actually this thing we got at. I don't remember. I think we got it at a yard sale or something. This is actually pretty cool. You just press the button right there. It's supposed to be like a doorbell if I can actually find it. And. Yeah, so that's practically everything here. 
That's everything really you need to show, you need to know, really. That's really my Halloween decoration. I could have went further on with it, because I guess I could have, um, there's more stuff back here I could probably could have used. But you know, it's fine. Yeah, I didn't go full on. Maybe I'll make another one sometime. So, this is the playroom I'm talking about, which I found that little dress. So, yeah. You yeah, know what? To end off this video, I'm gonna leave you in a dark room. Thank you.